Hi guys, so welcome back to another video. And today we are doing my makeup. Uh, I probably would do this because I thought, why not? Let's make another makeup video. I haven't done a sit down makeup video in a while. My room is a mess, so just like it's quarantine and everything. My bed's a mess. I should really should put it back together, but you know, I'm not going to. But I'm just gonna do like a quick little. I look so ugly with some, but it's fine. I gotta fix my necklace. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be doing this video. Well, you obviously know, and I'm just gonna do some products that I haven't used in a while. And in the last video, which you will see later on, I have to post other videos. This is my like everyday stuff, which no, I'm not gonna use everything that's right here. Everyday, maybe because that's a little too excessive. Excessive, but one of these over here could come my everyday stuff after using them. And oh, let's get started. Also, this isn't it, but like this stuff I have to kind of use every day because it's like I only have one of them. So, the first thing we're going to start off with is the Maybelline New Master Primer by Face Studio Primer Oxide Sunscreen Road. So, Spectrum SPF 30. That means like sunscreen only has 30 in it. So, this is actually good. It's Blur Plus Illumination. Luminate is 200. I actually have used like a lot of it. Uh, it has like this shade. It's like a really shiny shade. You don't want to put like, you know, too much on where you're like not hydrating your skin, not enough. But, like you don't want to put too much on where you're like breaking yourself out from it. But also you don't want to put not enough where there's not like covering well you also just don't want to put too much you just put like a good amount to cover your whole face but not too like thick so if you have like really thick and wet in one area then you just gotta do that i do use this you got on me i do use this every single day but it's fine okay so the next thing we're going to do is my concealer I have the Elf Hydrating Camo Satin Finish Concealer. It looks like this. Um, this is a very good one. A lot of people don't even like this one. A lot of people like the other one. But this is very full coverage. Like, a lot of people like the original. That's not hydrating. It's just a matte finish. Finish. I usually just go one, one, two, three. Sometimes even less. One, two, three. Because this actually comes out a lot. I just go boop, boop. Boop, boop. I usually do better than that. I usually go boop, boop. Oh, that's too much now. Anywhere that I have like a big pimple or anywhere, I just cover that up. Which I used to have a lot. I think I'm less breaking out. I'm not going to put that right there. Um, but yeah, my beauty blender, I'm going to have to get a new one. I'm not going to wet it, but... I've been using a brush lately, which is not a good decision, I don't think. Because it makes you, like, make up very patchy. It's hard to talk right now. And, I, you know, I'm not out for that. My bed should really be made, and I feel like a piece of crap for having my bed made. I'm actually talking pretty loud. And I usually don't talk loud when I'm making videos, because I don't want my mom or dad hearing me film. Because, I don't know. I feel awkward, but you know what? By the, oh, okay, well, I guess we're not using our hands on anything. Um, this might not be blending out the best, so, like, don't come at me. I'm, like, squeezing the thing, and now it's getting all over my hair. I don't have any makeup whites right now, so that's great. It looks completely not blended. Do you hear that? I see a lot of people like go like this. I'm just like, <laughs> that's not how you do makeup. Okay, uh, I'm not like a beauty guru, I guess. I want to be one day. Oh. Maybe not. I thought I just do makeup for a Okay. 
And then I sometimes add a little more if I feel I need it. Which under my, like, I'm not going to do that. That's disgusting. Well, I'll just swipe it on my legs. It's not really going to go away. I'm just going to get a little bit more concealer. And what I usually do with it is that, this is in the shade of light peach, by the way. I can't even see it. Oh, yeah, by the way, my thing is on my face mask, you know. My whatever face mask is, like, holding. By the way, I don't use any, like, eyelid primer or anything. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, next thing next, I go in with Agoma powder, which I have the CoverGirl Clean Perfection powder, which I usually use this, like, big brush, but I'll use this. You know, I'm going to start using a smaller brush. So I'm going to start using this to get, like, under my creases and just, and then that one I'll use for all over my face and everything. My skin has gotten like so much better than it has been. Okay, I should really start hurrying up, guys, because it's already at six minutes. Okay, but um, yeah. I think I might just post this video, guys, and then like these past videos i have have already been posted and everything so if you get confused by that that means you haven't watched this video but i'm probably just gonna post this one now so you guys have something because the other ones i might have to edit a little bit and other stuff sometimes i don't edit my videos which i know it's not like a very great thing i guess now i'm gonna go with my big brush and I'm just going to dip it in there once. And then I'm going to dust it off in this little container. Guys, do you see this? All that came off this brush. <sighs> okay, now I'm just going to go all over my face with this stuff. I'm going to do like a video of like... I don't really have any high head makeup. The only high-end makeup I have here is the Smashbox one. That's probably the... I believe that's a high-end makeup. Yeah, that's a high makeup. Smashbox is. That's not a drugstore makeup. I believe I don't think. I'm going to blow. If it is... I don't know how much, this isn't even all the powder. Most of the powder got up the top because I have it like this, sideways. Um, next thing next you're going to be, uh, you're serious, doing is we have to do bronzer, which the bronzer we're actually not using, we're actually going to be using this e.l.f. palette, which is the total face palette. Um, this, oh, but yeah, but um. Yeah, I don't want to do that because you can see me, but it's the Total Face Palette. Uh, this is what it looks like. Uh, I'm actually, I'm not going to, I might use the highlighter on my nose or something, but I have to wet it. But yeah, this is what it looks like. I don't use it that often. Okay, so the first thing you get to go in with is bronzer. And lately I've actually been using this brush for like everything. I don't really know, but I actually like this brush better than that big poofy one I just used. So I usually just go in with this. I have to like... I guess it's giving some transaction. Like, this looks different from this. I usually go like this. I know it's, like, not proper. It's actually not that bad. Oh. Like, actually... I didn't do anything to it. Keep on just hitting it. <sighs> An accident. I can't wait till we get to go on a trip. Um. <sighs> ah. <laughs> Ow. 
I don't see any. <sighs> I don't see any like bronze to it. You know, I think I kind of do. We're just going to go with that. Next, we're going to move on to blush. I think we're just going to try the lighter blush, and then we'll go to the darker one. These look like cream. I want to get the cream blush palette from them and a bunch. And I want to get the bronzer palette from them, too, with a contour palette. I want to get all of them. I just, I want to stock up on Elf products. I actually love Elf products, and I love a bunch of other products. Like, Maybelline's blush, they say it's really good. And I want to get all the Fit Me blushes. Oh, yeah. I have one other high-end. See Tave London blush, which um that's the only other high end blush I have, but it broke, so I have to fix it. <laughs> and this isn't that's not high end. What am I thinking? The See Tave London. Oh frick! You know we'll use this now. This is supposed to be used a while ago, but I'm just gonna apply it with my hands so I don't ruin it. You're supposed to use it to lighten your under eyes. I'll just add a little bit. It's like more of a shimmery thing, but it's really pretty for summer. And it lightens your other your under eyes. Which I kind of see why it's cute, but it's not the prettiest. But yeah. Also, I'm not gonna be using this highlighter for everything. I'm just gonna use it really quickly. Um next I'm gonna use my first brush. This is from Oh, um What and Wild, which you can barely see it. Um I'm gonna go with this lighter shade. Which, this doesn't, it kind of shows, actually. But it could just be the blush it has on it. I'm just going to blend that in. It's a little, like, right? Now I'm going to go with this darker shade. And just pack that on a little bit. I don't really put it anywhere else, but that's what I'm going to use. Oh, yeah, and then we have to do the highlight. Which, I'm just going to get blush. I have to put everything. I'll fix this later. Oh my god. Okay, and we're just gonna get into dip into this highlight a little bit. The highlight is I guess isn't that bad. It's just oh it doesn't have that much of a glow to it oh now you can see the glow a little bit i guess it's not the best it still smells like but look what happened i kind of like that next we're gonna go with our highlight which is this, this is the maybelline it is the holographic beam fabric of it, stellar lights palette um this i'm also gonna go with this um i think my palette the one i use the most is the gold shade you guys only see me and we're gonna go in with the freaking pink shade that i absolutely hate you know i kind of want to go for the purple it looks like we haven't used the purple that much so you know i would never go for like a colorful thing but when i saw this i was like but this looks purple. <laughs> okay, well, we're going to go. We're just going to take this and set it in there. Stop. I don't know what that was. But that's this palette. Which, yes, it's of the stupid clearance thing on it. Which I really take it off. I love that golden shade. It's perfect. Okay, let me fix this real quick. It's not that hard. Whatever. Okay, so um, the next thing that I'm going to go in with is eyeshadows. Um, now, <laughs> first thing I want to start off with my newer brush that I have. It is this Wet n Wild one. I found it the other day and I'm so happy. I have these two eyeshadow palettes. It's just one I do not like at all. But, you know, I think we'll start off with this like blackish shade. Which this does say it's supposed to go in the crease. <sighs> you, the, you're gonna think this is gonna turn out horrible. I'm sorry, looking in my mirror. 
We're just gonna put this all over the lid. That is so strong. And yes, it looks completely horrible. But I didn't want to put it all over the lid like that. I wanted to put it in the crease and it had to do that to me. So you know what's gonna happen. I don't want to ruin my makeup, so I'm just gonna do this. Okay, that I fixed a little bit. And we're just gonna put this in the crease. But I'm going to use this to mattify it. I'm gonna get more like, you know, stronger. Ah, okay, well, it's fine. We'll just take a brush. We'll fix it later, guys. This is gonna look really bad right now, but you know, it's gonna look really pretty. In a few minutes, so don't already start coming at me, okay? Next, we're just gonna take this lighter shade right here. Which, yes, I just used this brush. I'm just gonna take this lighter shade and I'm just gonna put it right in the middle and blend it with the black because I feel like that kind of gives the black a reflex or something like that, you wanna call it. And then this shade I'm not gonna use because it's just ugly. Next, I'm going to be taking is this brown shade, which is gonna go like kind of like I guess in front of the brown and I'm just going to take that <sighs> pack that on and it's just going to like you know blend it up it's kind of showing in the camera but it is like not showing up on my eyelid like it literally kind of looks like it is and I'm just going to get more into it like and it's just kind of blending the black and the gold together and then after you do that we're going to take this pinky shade and we're going to put this in the crease but now we're going to spray this one a lot to make sure it's really shimmery. You're gonna go with it. I don't even know if that's even showing freaking up. Oh, there. Okay, this is not the most best I look, but then we're gonna go back on the brown. Black, I mean, and we're just gonna pat that back on because I feel like that did not do much. I thought this has like okay, this eye look looks horrible, but I'm not the greatest artist right now. We gotta do the other eye. Watch this eye's gonna turn out so much better. Honestly, it's not even that bad. I give up on that eye. Okay, so just look at this eye. We're not gonna talk about this eye, okay? Okay. If you love me, we won't talk about this eye. I'll just be working on this eye for now. So, um, uh, yeah, I wanna add a mascara, which the first I do is I cut my eyelashes and then I, sometimes I put primer on and then cut my lashes. I think I wanna put primer on first. This eye actually looks good now. Oh, sorry, we're not done. Now we're going to take this brush, and this brush, we're just going to take this one right here. 
and then we're just gonna get it a little wet again don't look at this eye this goes in our brow It doesn't give that much highlight right now because you guys can't even see, but actually there's gonna great highlight. This side, most of the hitting this side, I'm actually kind of proud of now to compare. Okay, but now I'm gonna go in with the, uh, that I didn't actually not turn out that bad. Very proud of myself because it turned out better Guys, I know this side's horrible. Just please, please don't discard me for this. Stop watching me because of this. Guys, I think we're going to go big and go through our lips. Ow. I thought I was going to go with a different type of lip. lip but I kind of want to go with red lips for you guys. The other day, I tried, like, seriously, not even joking you. I literally tried to curl my bottom eyelashes. And that's not what that one's meant for. So... As you can see, I'm not the greatest at mascara. I actually used to be really good, but this one. Are you serious? I just poked my eye, I think, too. This eye just this looks horrible. It's fine. This can, like, blend out. Again, take the brush you have. Pat it over it, and it just. It makes it kind of blend away, and then you rub your hand on it, and it just. Okay. This makeup looks not very good today. But I was actually going to go for a different type of, like, not look. I, this is not going very well, is it? Nope. Oh, yeah, and then I just, I'll do that in a second. That brush fell. One second. It's been 22 minutes. <laughs> Sorry. This I'm actually very proud of. Okay, so this. Put all that. Okay, this I just put on my brows for one second. My brows need to be done again. And then after I like brush them, I just do this. And um, I need to take a shower. My brows really need to be done. Please hate to discard this eye. This is, eye is really bothering me. And that's all I do. And I, um, I was going to use these Avon one, so like these. But, you know, I'll be nice. And, you know, what I'm going to use is I'm going to use this red lipstick for you guys. What I've learned, before you have to let this dry. See, I'm going to look at my lips. You have to let this dry before you add the other half. I learned that because it actually needs to dry. I miss you. My makeup actually goes better than this. I'll be putting concealer under that. And then you left that dry. And I'm just going to take concealer. And put that under my lips. I swear, like literally, it can cover anything. Okay. She's perfect. She's a hair. She's worth it. She go deep with them. She's worth it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
see, and it's like getting barely anything on it. And this side's not dry. Oh my gosh. This actually stays on your lips. This is going to stay me. Great. But, yeah, guys. Um, I need to clean this brush now. But, um, put these back. Again, again, only look at this side, guys. And then, like, some of these products I'm probably never going to use again. But the thing is, actually, I probably will use this. This is probably going to go my everyday stuff a little bit. This I'll probably use maybe again. This, we forgot to set our face. That I'll use again. Again, don't look at this side. Look at this side. Well, guys, I hope you like this video. Subscribe, hit the bell down below to get notified when I make a new video. Like it if you like this video, and I hope you. I'll be posting this video before a lot of my other videos, which I made just a new video before this video, so on the same day. And yeah, I'll be posting this video soon, and then um yeah, I'll be posting soon again. And I really hope you like this video. And yeah, by the way, other videos after. This video has been way after all the other videos I'm about to post. Again, just to remind you guys, and I hope you liked this video, and subscribe. Love you guys, and bye.